Hello and welcome to Ndibu Tea. Hey, it's called just Ndibu Tea. Oh, and oh. I am Ndibu Tea. Okay, whatever. And I am Shudu Tea. Mm -mm. You are Shudu Chibat. <laughs> Why are you, <laughs> Why are you copying I'm Shudu Tea. Don't and be a copycat. No. no. You don't want to go there. No? You, no? you don't want to go no. there. I, I, don't, I don't have to remind you the fact that you took it from me. Eh? I'm the one. So are you saying that I'm a I'm the real Shudu Tea. From where? Eh? From where? Should it man? It doesn't matter from where. Should tea from where? It doesn't matter. My it point matters. is that my point is, is that I am, ID? I am should do tea. Is it on your ID? Should do tea. I have abbreviation. <laughs> Hi. That's why I'm saying I'm the real should do tea. Okay, so people, um, let's let's be serious now. This is yes, a serious. Yes, time to be serious. Topic, yeah? So now somebody asked on YouTube, obviously on the channel, on the comments. They asked, um, how do we keep our spark burning? That's the question that was asked. 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 Hmm? Yeah. How do, you, how do we keep our spark burning? We don't keep. We don't keep it burning. What do we do? Uh, we just ask now. Uh -uh. Okay. Okay, but yeah, on a, on a serious note, um, how do we keep our spark burning? I am... Um, Firm believer that um, keeping a spark burning a relationship is a must because once you no longer get those stomach butterflies when you see your partner, then you know there's something wrong. When you kiss your partner and you're just doing it for the sake of doing it, then there's something wrong. When you are making love and you're just doing it, you're basically just having sex, then there is something wrong in your relationship and it needs to be fixed. So you're saying just having sex is a problem? It is a problem. Like, you know, there's like, let's just do it quickie and then we do it for fun you know but not every time it's let's just have let's just have there needs to be oh sweet yeah. uh, oh, 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 you know, oh, oh, making love so stuff like that is that how so, you do it no i'm just making an example okay. yeah so I, I kind of feel like what you're trying to say is that um obviously you, you, you're just gonna say it in a better english so no, no 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 it's That's not fine. about that i'm trying to say that you're saying that if it's about uh the, the one party it's there's something wrong it yeah. has to be both parties benefiting from it yeah and sometimes it's also both parties just doing what needs to be done in a relationship and both of them not really feeling it you know mm. but just for the sake of so it doesn't really have to be like uh, the other party wants the other the other part doesn't want sometimes mm. it's both parties that are not feeling it but they do it because they feel it needs to be done in a relationship okay fair enough um so now i'm gonna <laughs> try and just uh, build up to this moment right yeah, build up, so build up. um let's let's look at ourselves right where we come from um, i mean in our marriage um from the time that we started dating until um today like we just put forward uh, some of the challenges that we we have went through uh, in relation to obviously keeping the spark going because mm -hmm. it's not like for us specifically everything has always been smooth Right. Yeah, it's been a roller coaster. It's been a roller coaster. So there were bad days, there were good days, and obviously we had to uh, do something about it in order for us to um, to, to to be here today. Uh, it's not been easy. So what what can you say? I mean, looking at where we come from and uh, where we want to go and where we are. What can you say in terms of keeping the spark going? What did you do differently when you were faced with challenges that needed you obviously to put back the spark? Okay, with me, every time, obviously, when I feel all of the spark, it's no longer there. I think I'm probably the first one to notice or someone just pretends as if he doesn't see that something is wrong. You know, it starts with me kissing my husband and I can feel, worry. I'm just doing it. And sometimes when I do it, I don't really realize that I'm just doing it because we do it in a relationship. Like, I just remember, I just think about it. I'm like, oh, I do kiss my husband, but it's different. Like, there's just nothing special about it. I don't even crave his kisses his lips at that time so i go back to the drawing board and i start doing things like um picnic romantic dates nights out and stuff like that and switching off the tv which now we have just permanently we don't watch tv unless if it's soccer and it's him who's watching so i don't watch a tv meaning that i've got enough time to bring up new ideas in a relationship so whatever that i feel like will build up I don't know. I'm not going to argue with you. I'm not going to debate with you. Don't. I'm not even going to query what you're saying. I'm just going to leave it like that. Even yeah, though you so say you've got enough time. Enough time for what? Sometimes even if I don't say I, I'm not feeling it, I'm not there. 
I just try to do it until I feel it. I mean, they say fake it until you make it. So even if it means putting up an alarm that every hour I need to just go to my husband and smooch him. I just go to my husband and kiss him. Sometimes just remind myself, okay, I need to be the one to say let's do jiggy jiggy, you know? Jiggy Such jiggy. things just to bring back this spark. Like kissing him every minute if I have to. Just so that we, even the body gets to, you know, they say the more you touch, the more you cuddle and everything. This is your favorite topic, eh? Hey, Bella, you're talking. Hey. Okay. Yeah, well, hey, you can continue. I don't mind, eh? No, okay, so what you're saying is that... Um, hey, why, why are you acting no, 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 like an no, no, interviewer? No, no. I'm an interviewer. Hey, I'm not an interviewer. Hey, wait, to wait, 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 wait. You talk too much. Keep quiet. Okay. Huh? Yeah. Uh, uh, so, so you're saying that um, it takes an effort. Yeah. That's that's what you're saying. Mm. A spark takes an effort. Yeah, so it's a hard work. It's, 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 it's true. I mean, there's no way... Um, where you will get a spark without putting an effort. It doesn't just happen. I mean, when you're growing um, as people that have been together for so long, right? You get to face different challenges. You get to go through certain moments that are obviously challenging. And obviously, we're living in a country or in a world that has got um, so many influences. You're influenced by your workplace. You're influenced by the kids that surround you. You are influenced by just the environment itself. So in order for you to step out of those moments, you need to, uh, to, 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 to uh, put an effort. It comes with an effort. Uh, so it, it, from my side, I believe that you need to put an effort, as he said, right? So it's not just going to happen automatically. What we do is that it's a daily effort that you have to put in. You forget sometimes, you step back to where, um, from where you're supposed to be, but you keep on doing it again and again and again. When you yeah. fail, you keep going. Yeah, if there's one thing that I do not, that I felt it takes away this spark, it's phone. Because when you're with your partner and both of you are on the phone, you are definitely in different worlds. He is communicating with other people. I am communicating with other people. And therefore, there's no way that we can, con we can connect. Because I will see him smiling. I'll also be smiling, on, smiling on, my own, on my side. Sometimes I'll be laughing out loud because, yeah, people are sharing jokes and everything. So I always feel like there should be time where in, there's just no form. Do you do that? Yeah? <laughs> do you do it? Do I do, I do it? Time, a time where there's no form? Yeah, I do that. Really? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> No, but, uh, it, ah. <laughs> okay, <laughs> it's fine, people, um, she said, I she... try not to, I try, but sometimes I, I'll, I'll be like, I told myself that I'm not gonna use phone when my husband is around, and as if you know, I am, I work with my phone, I should always be on Twitter, nice on, excuse. on social media, but he doesn't have an excuse, he doesn't work with his phone. I, I'll tell you my excuse, my excuse so is that she's using her phone, so I automatically step into using my phone, it's as simple as that. If she's using her phone, I can't just sit there and do nothing, and especially now that she's saying we no longer watch TV, what am I supposed to be doing, people? Like, watching tell me about it. Watching me? Watching you watch I, your phone. I feel like if, if you see that I'm on my phone, and you like, you want my attention, Get up, man. Strip. You know? <laughs> Obviously, I'm going to throw my phone away. Yeah. But you can't just say, because she's on the phone, let me be on yeah. the phone. Yeah. If, if you see that uh, you decide to stop, what do you do? If you decide to stop using your phone and you see that I'm on the phone? Me. Yeah. I don't stop. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Fair enough. So, I guess I'll, I'll, st I'll start stripping. Uh, I'll take lessons to strip. Anyone else who can strip, please do your thing. Eh? Hook me up so that I can learn to strip. No, no, no. I'm talking need, about guys. No, you don't need to learn to strip. It's just a matter of taking out, like take off your shirt slowly. And then I pull my, my underwear up. Yeah, and I'll come <laughs> and say, Pah! at the back, you know? Wait. And then you make noise and like, ah. Oh, Ooh. no, you're a guy. You say, <laughs> Okay, whatever. <laughs> Yeah, this topic is getting heated. I didn't know that it was going to go this direction. It's, it's yeah, but like... it's here now. But you guys know that we talk too much. So that is it. This is how we keep our spark. And any ideas that you guys have on how you, how you, keep, how you bring back the spark in your relationship, kindly share them down below. I mean, who would I feel? How do you say it in English? Learning doesn't... Never ends. Learning never ends. Yeah, learning never ends. So yeah, let's take this conversation down below on the comment section thank you so much until next time we appreciate you and if we ever love you. if ever you have um questions or you've got things that you want us to discuss or talk about or do or do yeah our, our son it's Billy saying ha huh, uh, that's how he thinks we are calling him but we are here on the video so yeah but anyway why are you if, blocking me because i don't want you to talk okay so if you guys 
are having like some challenges in life or just any topic that you want us to discuss kindly comment down below or hit us up on our instagram on my instagram it's at Nimo T. what did i say my son thought we were calling him so yeah we need to go unfortunately it's time to go and as she said please 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 whatever that you want to know um obviously with us growing up and having faced many challenges from an age of 21 and 19 um i want to believe that we we have faced a, a lot um especially growing into into this thing called marriage yeah so, so we've been in this thing for like mm, eight years or nine nine now nine nine years marriage mm. so we know quite a bit mm. and obviously we would share as plain as it gets we will say it the way you want us to bye guys bye i love you so much until next time, bye. Hey, tell them you love them. No, I don't love anyone. Hey, hey, tell them. I don't love anyone. It's not, it's not by force. Love, love is, comes from within. Huh?